All right, now we're doing 8Q training JS number 7, if, else, and ternary operator. This is by MyJinx in 2015, and 92% of the people like it. Uh, here's a bunch of words about the if, else, and the ternary operator. Uh, for the task, we're going to complete a function uh, that accepts one parameter in. In is the number of customers to buy hot dogs. Different numbers have different prices. Refer to the following table. Okay, so if it's less than five, charge them a hundred cents. Uh, between five and ten, ninety-five cents. Over ten, ninety cents. Okay. So for this one, we're going to use the ternary operation. And uh, if you don't know what that is, I'll show you in just a second. Okay. So the, turn, the ternary operator is the only JavaScript operator that takes three operands, a condition followed by a question mark, then an expression to execute if the condition is truthy, followed by a colon, and finally the expression to execute if the condition is falsy. The operator is frequently used as an alternative to an if-else statement. All right? So that being said, what we're going to say is in times, because uh, whatever the price is we're going to divide we're going to multiply it by in and inside of parentheses we're going to say if in is what is it less than five well, that's not less than less than five question mark then 100 is the price if not and in is less than 10 then 95 and if not that 90 okay and this should work let's see test it all right good attempt it looks good submit it all right very much like this one let's go to my solutions just a few of us best practice in my opinion and we'll see you next time